What's up guys, Nerd Up Desk here, and today we're going to be taking a look at AMD RAM Disk, which is kind of like an afterthought from AMD that allows you to use your uh, actual computer RAM as a drive, like a hard drive or a solid state disk. Though RAM is faster than a solid state disk, but let's see if this program can handle it well. Um, the RAM I'm going to be using today is... Um, ballistics if uh, you can check out the more information right here uh, CPU is providing you uh, the timing is 999.24 you know DDR3 uh, I have 16 gigabytes in total so um, you know that's that's the information on that uh, so that's the RAM we're going to be using and uh, we I'm going to compare this uh, against a Seagate Barracuda one terabyte and a Vortex for 128 or 120 gigabyte uh, SSD, and then we're going to be comparing it to the 4 gigabyte SSD that uh, Radeon RAM disk creates, and we're going to go ahead and create that right now. So just to do a little bit of uh, real time testing, here's the RAM disk, and here's the Vortex 4 SSD, and we're going to copy a 1 gigabyte file into the virtual drive, and that's about as long as it takes. So we're going to come back and I'm going to show you the uh, crystal disk marks um, for speed tests. Alright guys, we're back with the test results. Uh, I put a little notepad sticky thing next to each crystal disk mark is with a program that I use to test the hard drives. So in this comparison we're doing three hard drives. Uh, the one at the top is the AMD RAM disk hard drive which is amazingly sequential read is 3,770 megabytes per second, which is pretty damn good. The write time's even faster, which is just crazy. These these reads are insane compared to a solid state disk or drive. Sorry, solid state drive. Vertex 4 uh, solid state drive, which is a decent one, 120 gigabytes. Uh, it's doing sequential read at 362 megabytes per second which is f really fast don't get me wrong that's that's a f you know it's it's a solid state disk it's fast sorry solid state drive uh with the last one we have a Seagate Barracuda 1 terabyte which amazingly enough its sequ sequential read is 58.69 and uh e even in the uh, other scores it can get as low as you know less than 1 meg megabyte per second which is pretty terrible but even in the low ends of the RAM disk it's still a little bit lower than the uh, Vertex 4 in its fastest so what can be the uses of RAM disk um, I was thinking while I was running the scores what we could what people would use RAM disk for and RAM disk could be uh, very handy for people who are doing video editing um, because video editing uses, um, especially if you're doing something with After Effects or Premiere, you need a you know like a high read and write rate for your video because you're going to be you know cutting around so fast. And uh, possibly gaming, if you're into the, uh, you need to have the fastest thing possible. Yet again, uh, a lot of um, you know business applications, I guess, uh, not really. Uh, for the average computer user mainly because when you restart the computer the thing is gone now you can do you can save the disk to your hard drive and when it restarts you can put it back but you can't boot off of it which makes it almost useless and plus the size you know uh, the free version is maxed four gigabytes that's really you know what 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 use do you have for it so if you have a use for AMD Radeon let me know uh, below or AMD Radeon, Radeon RAM disk let me know below um, I hope you enjoyed this little overview and uh, I'll see you guys later